under the business plan and real estate, uh, should I anticipate building the restaurant around the building or build the rest, build the building around the restaurant? As in, using holy cow, buddy, tough question. <laughs> <laughs> I think what you're asking is, should I find the building and create a concept that goes in the building, or should I create the concept and then find the building that matches the concept? Precisely. Yes, on both. Here's why I say that. Certain markets, finding buildings are very difficult. So if you're smart, even though I have my five-phase process for starting a restaurant, you're going to have to start looking for the site much earlier than you would a less competitive market that has much more access to sites. Well, it's not unusual to find a grade A site, a site that is a wingdinger of a site that I'm going to be able to sell food and beverage out of, and then create a concept that matches that site's demographics and traffic. That's not unusual. However, you better be pretty good at creating a restaurant concept. Because you got to think of this in terms of a musician. There are one-hit wonders, and there's long-term 80s bands that everybody knows. I'm a child of the 80s bands, right? There's the one-hit wonder, and there's the 80s bands that everybody knows. The 80s bands that everybody knows can write all kinds of music, hit after hit after hit. The one hit wonder came up with one hit. Most independents, for that matter, most national chains are one hit wonders. There's plenty of national restaurant chains that continue to try to create new hit restaurant concepts and they don't hit because they're in the burger business and they don't know how to do pizza or they're in the pizza business and they don't know how to do burgers. So in the restaurant industry, for the most part, you're a one-hit wonder. Concept designers, which is what we do for a living, we have to sit here and create concept after concept after concept after concept. And they got to be hits. Well, so if you're going to pick the site and then create a concept to go in it, you better have a concept designer help you do that. It's easier to create the concept, especially as an independent, create the concept that you're passionate about, and then find a site that matches your concept. <laughs>